tonight the final installment of the Aces and Condors forever for regular season play. Mike Benton with you here from Rebel Bank Arena. 7 o'clock face-off locally. We're on air 15 minutes before puck drop on KFQD. Joining us now, Aces forward Chris Francis. And Chris, it's your first season in Anchors, but you've been a part of this building for a while, coming in playing with Las Vegas previously. What are the challenges in trying to play through the atmosphere like this each and every game? Uh, you know, this team, they always come out hard in their, in their arena. You know, they, they have really good starts, and, uh, you know, you got to pay attention in this rink because uh, the glass is pretty lively. It's dark in here, so you, you can lose the puck pretty simple. So uh, we just got to be ready to go and match their intensity right off the bat. Being ready to go is certainly an important part this late in the regular season. The Ace is obviously battling for their lives right now as far as a playoff position. How has essentially everyone, top to bottom, adapted here to the phrase that this is just like the playoffs right now. I think everyone's doing a really good job. You know, we went into Ontario. We got one out of the three games. You know, we, we wanted to get a couple more. But uh, I feel like we didn't get outplayed, you know, the whole series. I thought we, were, we hung in with one of the top teams. And we're playing, we're playing a hard game. Everyone's playing the same way. And, you know, we got to block shots, get pucks in deep, and, you know, go to work. And guys are really doing well doing that. This team has got to be good each and every night here, but how better were they on Saturday against Ontario? It was lights out, unbelievable. Our, def our goalie, our defense, everyone was just really, you know, bearing down, getting the pucks out of our zone, doing the little things, you know, what it takes to win hockey games, and that's huge. It shows the, you know, the, the effort is there every night from this group, and that's something huge. What changes or what has to stay the same in period one as comparable to Saturday? Uh, no, we, we got to do exactly what we did. We get, we got to pick up where we left off. You know, we took the took the game to them, and that's what you need. We gotta, we can't come out and take a break for ten minutes of the game and not be ready to go. Hi, JJ. But uh, yeah, so we just gotta, we just gotta make sure things are ready. We're ready to go and keep the pedal down. What challenges here do you have to maybe overcome when you have someone breathing down your neck, whether it might be an opponent in your tracks, or maybe even uh, one of the toughest men in pro hockey like Justin Johnson? <laughs> JJ, he's a big teddy bear. Look at him back there. No, he, he is, isn't he? He's one of the he's one of the best leaders I've ever played with. So it's good to have him on your on your side. This is the best interview ever. <laughs> <laughs> The love spreads for Justin Johnson to Chris Francis and amongst the rest of the Aces as well. Chris, good luck here. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Aces take on the Condors this evening. We'll talk to you 545 Alaska time on KFQD. Enjoy the game.